Once you have lifted a pupa, you can carefully loft it in the direction you face or simply drop it in front of you. This pupa will need a mother. Nice toss, two legs. Fire crystals will be used to create a potion that will return you back to your human size. You will need to collect 100 of them. Two-legger. You can also do a powerful attack by charging with your staff outstretched. survive. Oh, 
kid. You'll need to know how to swing that staff if you want to survive. Well, those bugs won't be coming around here anytime soon. Made them mad now. That was easy. They sent him to save us. Uh. You want a trick to get rid of the predator bugs? They're you everywhere. The made them mad now. We can't save them alone. These pests mad now. Good luck. This is Praise the mother. Save these caterpillars as well. Very dangerous attacks with their tail. Okay, two legs. We ants can communicate even if we can't see or hear each other. We can do this through something called telepathy. Keep an eye out. If you need a ladder, go to the telepathy marker and call your teammates. Remember to wait until the ladder is built before climbing it.
The slingshot lets you cross large gaps by tossing you, catapult style. Call the ants and they'll build a tower. Then climb to the top and start swaying back and forth. Let go at the right time and you'll be airborne. Get through large gaps littered with poles, climb to the top of the ant tower and move it back and forth. With the larva silk squirter, you will paralyze enemies for a few seconds when they are hit. Don't forget the lock-on feature to help with aiming. This weapon is very effective against flying insects. Guest worker ant. Good job. 